What's going on guys? It's your boy Wes. God damn. Skin is glowing. It's a secret. I'm not gonna tell you guys what it is. Nah, I'll, I'll let you guys know. It's those cold showers, baby. That and semen retention. But anyways, I'm excited today. Uh we're going to do the spotting race. I'm actually going to pick up one of my homies right now. He he's done it before, so I never it's my first time. But yeah, I'm fucking I'm so excited, man. Can't wait to uh get over there and start climbing and start uh, you know running around like a monkey. My boy, this is my boy Kenny right here. What's good? Yo, my man got a whole bag of what's in there, bro? Uh well I got hash browns, but the main thing that we want to get is mustard. And why we is got that? Mustard packets, bro. Why is so, that? So, apparently, I mean, I, from what I've been told and what I've seen, mustard helps with cramping. So, like, I think it's the salt in the mustard. So everybody yeah, who does it's gotta the, be yeah, the salt. It's definitely whoever does the yeah. whoever does the Spartan race, they always say like, bring mustard packets. So like, if you cramp up, just take them, and then you'll be good. So that's what, that's what helped me the first time. I was like dying, and then. Freaking somebody helped came to the side like, yo, you good? You want some mustard? And I was like, <laughs> okay, honestly, yo, he's like, it helps. Crazy. And I'm like, all right, whatever, it's gonna help me. Yeah, I don't yeah, even yeah. like mustard, bro. Like, oh, fuck it, yeah. Yeah, I was like, yo, it's gonna help me out. Yo, give me that. I was like, <laughs> that's that's. I guess I guess it works, cause yeah, like he said, the salt. But I might have to try myself if I cramp up, you know. But like I said, it's not a long race. It's what three miles, right? I think about Something three miles. Like, yeah. So um, you know, I'm excited for it, man. But I'm gonna catch up with you guys later. Yo, guys, so we are here, my boy Kenny. Yo, we ready for it. We got the headbands on and everything. There's a lot of people, way more people than I expected. Yeah, I think it starts over here somewhere. But, uh, we about to go to Bats, like, and after that, we're gonna. We, we got to 12, so that's good. We changed the times and stuff. Uh, and we got some time. Uh, I thought I was worried that, like, you know, I had a different time and he had a different time. I thought they were gonna be strict and not let us go at the same time, but we worked it out. We Pretty worked good. it out. Yeah, there's no, no, no stress, you know. But uh, let's get going. I'm gonna try to, I'm gonna try to record a little bit for you guys, you know, if I can, you know, because uh, I can't bring the camera anywhere. I can't bring it with me running, you know. <laughs> <laughs> so. Uh, uh oh. It's an urban double takeover. Double takeover on the main stage, ladies and gentlemen. Oh my God! This is it's from when the the the, 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 the twig. Oh, the it, twig. It, yeah, that shit messed me up. That's all good. To the left. I'm not here to look pretty anyway. Oh, <laughs> twelve Hey, get it, get it, get it. Get those dance moves, boys. Hey, hey, come on, man. <laughs> We got like a, what was it, an hour and 18 minutes? Hour and 18, hour and 18 minutes, yeah. It's pretty good. I, I'm not gonna lie, I was telling him I got humble real quick because going through that and doing that run, you know, I don't, I don't really do cardio so much, but that shit humbled me, man. OD, bro. Yeah, so um, I'm gonna definitely do it again. I'm gonna definitely come out here again. Uh oh. I actually won the pull up challenge, so I'm excited about that. And I think we think he won the dead hand cat challenge too, so that's two Oh, yeah, free races. I, just, I just asked the lady, she said I won both, so that's you get two free races. Yo, what I told him is this was too late for him, bro. He's gonna do the beast with me. That's a true test. Yo, what is that? Like uh, uh, 13 plus, 13, 13 plus miles. Plus miles. Yeah. He did it, he did it before, he knows how it is, so. Yeah, it's just rough. That's I did two. One of it took me seven hours. The other one took me like eight and a half. That shit is rough, man. Shit is rough. So, you know, if you guys are down, any of, any of you guys, you know, into that, you know, come on, contact me, you know? And, um, you know, we'll have a good time. This is definitely good training. And also, you know, my boy, uh, you know, Kenny, he does, uh, he does, uh, uh, B boy and you know all those dance dance moves you guys own. You, know, you do the, you go to different studios. Right? Yeah, I work at different yeah. studios. I be everywhere in New York City. You know what I mean. So if I ever see you around, if you ever see me, you know, say what's up, man. I'm always in class. Yeah, I'll link his Instagram below. You know, so you guys can check out his page and stuff. But um, 
You know, I'm gonna catch up with you guys later. Yo, what's up, guys? So we bought a bunch up right now. This looks so good. I always come to this spot, you know, uh, Mexican restaurant. I'm gonna show you guys what we about to eat. Yo, what do you think? It smells good, right, bro? Yeah, I'm ready to eat, bro. Yeah, he's ready. Yeah, you see that, guys? So I'll catch up with you guys later. Yo, 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 what's up, guys? Um, so I'm back home from that spawning race. Yo, I had a I had a great time. My legs are shot. Um, I'm definitely doing that again. Like I said, uh, I got the free race, so I gotta wait till they email me and let me know which one I won. I don't know if it's another sprint or it's any kind of race. Well, I won two. One for pull-ups. Um, doing the most pull-ups, I did. 35 in one minute and also doing a, a dead hang uh, basically just on the pull-up bar and you hang on the bar for uh, I, however long as you can and I was there for two minutes and 30 31 seconds I think it was so I won that too actually you know um, yeah man but that's that sprint even though this was the first one it's it's a humbling experience. I kept telling my, my boy, I was like, yo, yo, I'm humbled, man. This shit is, uh, shit is crazy. But we got through it. You know, we finished it. And I'm just glad I was able to, um, you know, do that. I, I've been wanting to do this for, I think it's been like two or three years. I was saying, yeah, I want to do a spawning race. I want to do a spawning race. I just never really had, I didn't want to go there alone. I didn't really have any friends that, you know, that were interested or if, you know, I did, you know, they, they had schedules that, that didn't work out. So, you know, I'm glad I went. It's going to be a thing now. I'm going to be going all the time. You know, um, I love this kind of stuff, man. Like I said, anything that's a challenge, I'm always up for it. All right. But um, the, the day is not over, guys. Uh, right now. I'm about to actually go to the gym. You might be thinking, yo, you crazy. You just did a, yeah, I know, but <sighs> discipline, that's what it is. That's what keeps me going. When things get harder and when things are more difficult, let's say, for example, like today, I just did that. That's when it means more. When you're tired, when you got no, when you got no energy in you, you know, things mean a lot more. All right, so I'm going to record that as well. We're going to do chest and tries. Um, we're going to do a crazy workout. All right, so you guys stay tuned. Chest. That was a pretty good workout. As you guys saw, 
we were supposed to start start with the cables, but we started with the uh, the, the flies just because somebody was using it. The reason we did that was uh, just to get the blood flowing into the chest. And um, he tried it one more. It was pretty good, right? Yeah. It was a good pump. So after that, went to the incline. We did that, and um, after that, we went to incline dumbbells just because I'm trying to focus more on my upper chest. And for my lower portion, I'm just doing regular flat on the hammer strength. And we finished up, uh, I think that was it, right? We finished up with the uh, push-ups over here for yeah. chest. Now, he was actually telling me about a, a program he follows, which I think I'm gonna start incorporating, just to switch things up a little bit. It's kind of like a five, five by five of your 70% of your one rep max just to increase my strength a little bit. I want to change things up. So anyways, we're gonna do the tricep portion of it. So you gotta stay tuned. guys so we're doing a tricep right now with the rope basically we're gonna come back and do 10 like this and just come straight forward do 10 and then do reverse 10. it's a killer I just did my first set and I feel so fatigued I had to drop the weight a little bit but I'm gonna show you guys Shit, yo, I think I'm gonna need a, a, a size large after this. You're gonna need an extra large. Fuck. Oh, you see, baby? Let me see. 